future of Ghost has been solidified now after news is just coming in today that the lawsuit against Tobias Forge, who proclaimed that he was the founding member and controlling interest in Ghost, has been dismissed. This after his former bandmates who were in the band filed a lawsuit against him after departing the group, claiming that they were being withheld controlling interest, which they said was equal in the band, and also that they were not being paid adequately by Forge. This is a major victory for Tobias Forge. The trial, which took place in Sweden, lasted for the last six days, and at 11 a.m. today, a 108-page decision from the judge was released, issuing a swift dismissal. The four former Ghost members also, unfortunately for them, have to pay Tobias's massive legal fees, which he claimed were over $225,000 if you convert it to U.S. Uh, the judge brought that down just a little lower to $146,000, still a massive penalty for suing someone, uh, which you know, is what people don't typically hear about is that you've got to end up paying legal fees. So uh, the original lawsuit said that Forge was the sole controlling interest in the band's business affairs and would not take input from anyone else. They also said that they had a partnership agreement between Forge. Uh, they let him be in charge of their management duties, but they still said they were equal members. So uh, they had members who were in the band from... 2010 until 2016, uh, 2011 until 2016. This all happened in late 2016 before Tobias brought in new members of the band. They said that for years, Tobias never told them that he viewed the band as a one-man business project. It said in a statement to the contrary, Tobias Forge has always emphasized that it was a collaboration, that everyone was involved and would share the profit of once the business became profitable. The first time Tobias Forge, through the band's management, mentioned that he saw them as hired musicians rather than full-fledged members of Ghost was the context of a contract proposal presented in April 2016. The members rejected, and a few months later, they were out of the band, which ultimately led to the lawsuit. Obviously, here now, this will carry on having Ghost as a one-man controlling interest with Tobias being, as he's been referred to recently, the director of Ghost. Uh, we all obviously know, not to break the fourth wall here for those of you who don't, but obviously Tobias is the man who portrays Cardinal Copia. He is a creative visionary, and he is certainly capable and uh, deserving of this uh of this dismissal here in court. So uh, congratulations to Tobias. This is a monumental victory, and Ghost fans should be happy about this, regardless of how you feel about the past events. This solidifies Ghost being able to carry on as a band. This is very, very good news, uh, but an unfortunate loss for those who saw it the other way. Uh, we will keep you posted on this situation and any reaction from former members of Ghost or Tobias himself. That is all we know for now. Thank you so much for tuning into Rock Feed. Don't forget to subscribe with notifications on so you don't miss out on breaking hard rock and heavy metal news. Thanks so much for choosing Rock Feed, and we'll see you all very soon.